A study released just moments ago has important information about a vaccine for women who are having a baby. Medical reporter Liz Bonus joins us now with more in today's Health Alert. Liz. Good afternoon, Paula. The study just released says there is no risk associated with giving the vaccine to women to help prevent whooping cough when they're pregnant. It comes from the Journal of the American Medical Association, where researchers looked at adverse outcomes in pregnancy, such as early delivery, babies born at lower birth weights or small for gestational age, and even the rates of higher blood pressure in pregnancy. They found no increased rates for any of these complications for women given this vaccine. It's generally called the Tdap vaccine because it's combined with tetanus and diphtheria. Whooping cough, which is also called pertussis, is highly contagious. It's a bacterial infection that can be deadly to newborns. It causes a whooping sound that often sounds like this and interferes with breathing. Keep your hand up. Keep your hand up. It's okay. It's all right. Experts at Cincinnati Children's and the Cleveland Clinic, who helped supply that YouTube clip and this video, say researchers studied 26,000 women to find this out. The women were given the vaccine while pregnant and did not have a greater risk for preterm births. Babies were not born smaller for gestational age and moms did not have higher rates of high blood pressure in pregnancy. Now doctors, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommend Tdap vaccination for pregnant women between the 27th and 36th week of pregnancy. And they do this because then mom builds up antibodies and passes it to the baby. Okay. Yeah. So once the baby's born, you can't give that vaccine for the first six months at least, and it will protect the baby. And pregnancy programs now in hospitals, they've also started giving it to caretakers. You know, if, if there's going to be a dad around or whatever, they'll give you the vaccine as well when mom's pregnant so that you can catch that, well, that and give sense. it to baby. It's an excellent yeah. program. St. Elizabeth has one. Yeah. And the correct pronunciation is? Well, we say whooping cough because you heard that sound like whoop, whoop when you cough, and that's where that comes from. But, Brad, I know you're a sports guy, so. I like a whoop. whoop. Whooping, whooping cough. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we will take it either way as long as you share the proper information. Back in 30 with an update.